Ladies and gentlemen, hello and welcome back to Prison Architect. Now, the first thing I want to say about this is uh, is this is going to be the last episode of Prison Architect for quite a while. And uh, and the reason is, you know, I've just got a little bit bored of recording it. So, you know what, we're going to put it on hiatus for a while, but if this video gets some love, then I'm sure we'll bring it back eventually. Um, you know, that that just depends on, on how much you guys want to see it. And, you know, if you do, then make sure to give it a like, subscribe, comment down below you know always appreciate it always read the comments always read the feedback and uh, I do love the feedback that you guys leave uh, it does help me play the game better oftentimes uh, so it is, it is really really very good okay so what have we got to do in today's episode well we want to finish off this area and we want to get it 100% up and running and um, we also need to get two armed guards which is what I think we're going to do now before we actually run out of money so uh, so that'll be a nice easy way to uh, to enter into this episode if we can find armory somewhere yes it is there that's not how it's gonna look we're gonna make this entire room in armory beautiful okay what does it need weapons rack guard locker and a table I am fine with doing that we'll stick a table that's a bench we'll stick a table in there we will stick two well one weapons rack and two guard lockers so that we can get lots and lots of guards. In fact, let's, you know, let's go, let's stick lots of guard lockers in. Nice. That's fine. That is good. And then we can assign two armed guards to a patrol, and that'll be fine, and we can get armed guards patrolling around the place and uh, suppressing prisoners like it's nobody's business. So, so that is going to be good. We're also going to put some jail doors here and here, so, uh, so prisoners... Don't uh, don't think twice about escaping. Uh, we've got lots of people in solitary. One person awaiting. That is fine. 24 people require medical attention. I think we replenished our supply of doctors. Yes, we did. We now have two doctors again. That is nice. Why are why is nobody on this? There should be somebody over here. We also need to set up CCTV in this area. Uh, that is something that we've actually been quite lax about so far. So that's uh, that's going to get done today. For sure, cannot afford to go any longer without CCTV to uh, to the essential areas. So that's going down. And of course, we have prisoners arriving. How could we forget? We have uh, lots and lots of prisoners arriving. We have 15 arriving, and I'm not quite sure if they're going to be max, minimum, or uh, or normal security. So we'll have to wait and see. That is going to be very very exciting indeed. Now let's get some armed guards. Whoa 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 whoa! whoa. We do not have enough money. To buy a second armed guard. Oh no! Now we're in trouble. Let's uh, let's start selling off some of this stuff. Um, sell object. Perhaps we can raise one and a half grand in uh, in selling off these objects. Hey, we did it! And now we can finally buy our second armed guard. That's great. And then we can assign them both to some you know pathetic route that uh, that nobody really cares about. There we go. Two guards, two guards assigned. Uh, where's our other dog handler? Why? Where's the other dog handler gone? Dog patrol. Where is he gone? He's chilling up here. He's slacking. Oh goodness sake! Come on, man. Get back to work. What on earth? The dog is sleeping. Oh, what a lazy dog. Get rid of that dog. Jeezy peeps. Nah, I joke, I joke. We'll, we'll get that achievement done uh, eventually. Uh, not an achievement, what am I talking about? We'll get that grant done eventually. Um, we haven't really made much headway with this education thingy. Um, that's a bit disappointing. How far are we through it? We're almost done it, in fact. We're almost done it. One, ten, 10 to 1 a.m., we, uh, we have a class on. That's fine. So perhaps we will, we will see them coming into the classroom with the teacher... And, uh, and getting educated, which is awesome, because we like educated prisoners. And, uh, and now we're a thousand bucks in the hole. That's, uh, that's not a good place to be. Not a good place to be at all. And we, bear in mind, we actually only have eight available guards. So that is less than ideal. Plus, we do not have anybody to, uh, to monitor this monitor, so to speak. Which is a little bit worrying. And here's the teacher going to teach these, uh, these hooligans... That's fine. It's almost 11 a.m. That means everybody's like an hour late to lessons. 
That's uh, that's not good. That's not good commitment, guys. <laughs> you need to be uh, you need to be more committed than that if you uh, if you want to learn. Looks like our doctors are hard at work healing up all the prisoners that have been injured in the riots, and uh, and we got a new contingent of prisoners, and those contingent that contingent of prisoners, should I say, is being moved into their cells. That is good. Hopefully, we'll have enough capacity for it. Where is the dog? Why is the dog moved? Oh, can I hear the start of a riot? I hope not. I hope not. Oh, looks like there's fighting going on here. You need family and clothing. Oh, you're trying to smuggle something. Oh, it's all heating up now. But at least some prisoners are getting educated. Doesn't look like the teacher's doing much educating, to be honest. But uh, hey ho, got a couple in there learning how to do stuff, and they've got half another half another half an hour, another half. That's what I meant to say. Another half hour of lessons that uh, that they're going to be taught. So let's uh, let's do the, let's do a test, right? You are going to be moved to no maximum security to supermax, right? Just as a test, and then. You, no, yeah, you, come here, there we go. You're going to move to protective custody, so see if that works. And hopefully you'll be moved down to a cell down here, if we've got it all deployed correctly. I think we do. I think so. I think it's not too shabby. There we go, let's get rid of guards there. Didn't mean to. I didn't mean to do that either. I meant to uh, click that, and then click that. Fantastic. Protected only in that area, that's fine. Although we should probably have some guards stationed around here, but for now, since there's nobody in it, we don't really need to worry about that. Where's our Where's our Mr. Protective Custody? You're watching TV by sitting on the TV. Well, you know, it's a method, uh, not one that I'm I'm very aware of, but uh, but hey ho. Now, has a foundation education program been completed yet? No, so close, so close to completing it. And um, we do have three people that have passed our actual work shape, work shape? workshop safety induction. Uh, finally, if I can get my words out. Um, yeah, that's that's good. Behavioral therapy, why don't we start that if we can? Yep. Start lots of lots of rooms. No, there's only there's only two. That's fine. Um, alcoholics group. Can we start that as well? No equipment. Oh, well, I guess we don't have the equipment for that, and I don't think we're going to invest in the equipment in that. We did get our 15 grand. That is awesome, which means we can finally uh, get rid of these stupid deployment routes for, for the dogs and for basically everybody. Just completely abolish them. Uh, let them let them go around. Chill. You guys get in there. See what's happening. Oh, look, our protective custody guy is coming down. That is good. That's very, very nice indeed. And uh, and we can probably start linking up our CCTV cameras. Um, now I know we did talk about doing it in the uh, in the maximum security area, but we're going to link up these because we have the security cameras already in place. And yeah, you're right there. That's awesome. It actually works. This entire thing works. Wow, that's going to be a, a lonely existence for you. Wow. It's like being in solitary confinement, eh? And the guard looks like he's trapped. Get out of there. Get out of there, buddy. Wow. So, yeah, wow. I, I think we've I think we pretty much finished this block in terms of functionality. I mean, I'm not sure if we want to offer the prisoners any more functionality. I mean, they've got a shower. They've got a yard. Don't really need a common room, do they? They've got a kitchen. They've got a canteen. They've got everything that these guys have got, apart from some solitary cells. Uh, and those aren't really necessary. Could give them a common room, perhaps an infirmary. We're not giving them a visitation room. Heck no, that is not happening. Hopefully we're not over capacity in anything. No, we are at uh, 35 maximum security inmates. Our capacity for that is 37, so we're going to want to turn off maximum security intake. So let's do that now, actually, just in case. Um, prisoners, yeah, high-risk prisoners off. Fine. So we're only going to take in normal and minimum security prisoners, which is fine. You know, they're easier to handle. They don't bring us in, you know, the same amount of money. But at the same time, it's nice to not deal with it. Okay. Why are you dead? You're a snitch. Ah, that's so annoying. That's so annoying. Ah. Do we need to check everybody's reputation? Like, 
is that something we need to do from now on? And check if they're a snitch? Because I think that might be necessary, you know? Just in case. All the new intake of prisoners from now on will get searched to see if their uh, if their reputations are snitchy. And if so, they're going to get moved over here. You know what? You just pulled a short straw, buddy. You're going to left over here. You are you're not getting out, not at all. Not in uh, not in the near future anyway. Why has that not got water? It's cuz we haven't put pipes into it. That's uh that's a bit silly. Don't know why we we forgot to do it. Hey ho, we uh, we've sorted it though, and and that's fine. We still have fifteen grand in the bank, so that puts us in a good position for when we want to resume uh, from our hiatus. If we want to come back to it, if indeed you know it's it's popular and it's requested, but if it's not, you know we'll just we'll just leave it and forget about it for now. Um, but yeah, you know we can come back to it anytime we want. I mean, it has been a good prison, and I've I've probably enjoyed this prison more than I did the last one, purely because you know. I, I planned it out better, and I think we've actually, even though it's a little bit more expensive to run, I think we've actually done a considerably better job managing this prison. I mean, we only had one riot. We have completed a heck of a lot of grants, a heck of a lot quicker. Um, let's go and have a look at our grants, actually. Cell block D. We haven't done that yet, and we haven't done this, but we... We haven't done this either, actually. Let's let's start the stuff on bureaucracy now. We might as well. What is it we need to do? Body armor and tasers. That's it. Well, both of them are very easy to do. Nice. Uh, and we'll we'll be finished them in six hours or so. So that puts us in a good position for the future, and we'll have an extra twenty, well, forty grand effectively, uh, in the bank for when we come back. If of course we do come back, you know, people might not want me to play it again, and you know what? I get that. That's totally fine. Um, if you don't, then you know. Leave me a comment down below. Tell me, uh, tell me that you don't want to see me play it again. Uh, if you do have everything, you know, make sure to make it, make me aware. You know, whatever. Just tweet me. Do something like that. I don't know. I'm trying to plug my Twitter, but it's, uh, it's not working. Um, yeah, no. Tweet me. Leave a comment. Some something like that. I'm sure you'll think of creative ways to get in contact with me. Smoke signals. If you think that works best for you, then you know what. I I'm not opposed to smoke signals. I think smoke signals are, you know, very cool. It's just, you know, got access to the internet, then you might as well, you know, email me or tweet me or send me a message on Facebook. Anything that's easier than going outside and making a fire and making smoke signals. But I uh I don't mind whatever whatever you choose is best. Um so yeah, I'm I would say I'm pretty happy leaving our prison in a condition like this. I mean, we've only got two people in solitary and one person awaiting. Two people in lockdown, um, one person in solitary confinement now, actually. That's good, so it looks like somebody was just released. And two people require medical attention. Now, something we didn't do with this, right, was, uh, was change our policy around. And in the last prison, we had people in solitary for ages. However, we, uh, we haven't really here. Um, let's, let's mark all these. There we go. Yeah, we haven't really upped our punishment. And you know what? We could do that. And I, I wouldn't be opposed to doing that. But it's just we haven't in this episode, uh, or haven't in this series, should I say. Uh, let's go and have a look at our grading. Our security is minus three. Our punishment is one. Our reform is like is like nothing. Twelve deaths in custody. Seventeen prisoners escaped. That's, that's not a record to be proud of. And our prison value is minimal, I would say very minimal in comparison to you know the million and a half that we had last time but hey ho i'm i'm not complaining we've had a very very successful series both of the series have been have been you know some of my most popular series and i hope you guys have enjoyed them as well and uh, it's it's bringing a tear to my eye about how we're finally saying goodbye to this beloved game that i've played so much of in the last couple of months i really have enjoyed it very much you know um it's just, I just, I presume it's just because I've played it so much that, you know, we're going to give it a rest. And I think, I think that's fine. You know, we're not committing to never return, to, re, never returning to it. And I think we're leaving the prison in a good state. I mean, danger level is low. Everybody's relatively happy. We got quite a bit of money. We got a decent cash flow. So overall, yeah, I would say I am proud of this prison and I am... I am. I'll be sad to see it go, but at the same time, it'll it'll give me an opportunity to to get on to something else and uh, and have a good time. We can sell these license plates, can't we? Yeah, we can. Wood. We're not going to sell that, but we are going to sell these license plates. Get us a little bit of money. 
So, so yeah, for the last time in, in this series of, of Prison Architect, thank you very much for watching, ladies and gentlemen. My name's been Orbit Potato. If you have enjoyed the video, which I hope you have very much indeed, then please remember to leave a like, subscribe if you want to. My name's been Orbit Potato, and I will see you next time. Bye.